The government claims to have unearthed another scam of former Prime Minister Nawaz Sharif relating to his private visits abroad at the government's expense, causing losses running into millions of rupees to the National Exchequer. Nawaz Sharif has made 25 private foreign trips during his rule from 2013 to 2018 on taxpayers' money of Rs 250 million, the Prime Minister's advisor on accountability. Shahzad Akbar, said at a press conference on Thursday. Mr Akbar, who is also head of the Assets Recovery Unit, said that of these 25 foreign trips, some were made to Saudi Arabia to perform Umrah along with family members and friends. Although Mr Sharif is a rich man, even then he performed Umrah on taxpayers' money, he said. The advisor also gave details of misuse of official aircraft for private tours by Mr Sharif saying his one Umrah trip cost RS 35M. Responding to a question, he said the ARU had completed its investigation into the private foreign visits of the former Premier and referred it to the National Accountability Bureau NAB, as a fresh case of misuse of authority. Some other cases of misuse of authority are already being investigated against Nawaz Sharif and it will be the fresh one and will be dealt with separately by NAB, he added. Mr Akbar claimed that under a recently signed agreement on exchange of information about assets of citizens, the Swiss authorities would provide details of Pakistani's assets stashed in Switzerland within the next six weeks. He said the treaty had been pending for the last five years and the last Pakistan Muslim League Nawaz's government had intentionally ignored it. The advisor alleged that the PMLN rulers had avoided signing the agreement to save their own skin. Otherwise details of their assets in Swiss banks could have been exposed. He said the government had information that after the Panama Papers leaks most of the Pakistanis had shifted their money and assets from Switzerland to other countries. As a result.